This is what it looks like when you do a craft project in the bus. Hi, Frank. Excuse me, ma'am. Is it are these yours? Are you working on this? Move along, go on. Today I finally managed to finish replacing our bulky curtains with new fresh and fun curtains. This is gonna be our kitchen curtain. It's a tea towel that has like all these cool little measurement things on it. So I'm really excited. I think that'll be super cute. So we have these tension rods and then these things. So right now what I'm doing is I'm reclaiming the blackout portion of these curtains. I have these for opening bedroom windows. I'll have these cute green panels, but they're just, they're thick canvas, but they don't block out the light. So I cut a piece of the blackout I want to line these ones up so that I'm going to whip stitch that together. I usually sew my entire window panels, but this time I wanted some instant gratification, so I compromised and purchased placemats, napkins, and tea towels. What did you say? Get the fuck out! <laughs> what do you think of the kitchen one? It looks cute. Good job. What about the bathroom one? I hate those. Really? They're terrible. All right, so I'm gonna stop recording there and I'm gonna show you when I put the panels up. All the curtains in the bed area are made with placemats and the ones in the bathroom are made with napkins. In addition to working on the curtains, we've been also working on streamlining some of the other features of the bus. We have some much more accessible storage here in the kitchen area now. And I love the way the tea cloth worked out for the kitchen window. The curtain system I had in the bathroom before was almost completely unusable, and the ones in the bedroom were just entirely too bulky for the space. These windows will be so much easier to open when it's time to drive. These magnetic hooks have been working great for hanging clothes and keeping anything off the ground. And we hang our jackets in front of the driver's side door for a little privacy on that side. I made this out of a Folgers container to hold my sewing kit. If you like videos like this, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to follow along with our journey day by day.